Her Royal Highness came to welcome a new era of military music training. The Alford School of Music, named after a musician who served in both Royal Marines and Army, will be the training home for the Royal Marines Band Service and Royal Corps of Army Music. At its heart, this building, once a Victorian prison in use until 1990, now repurposed into practice rooms. For the Army musicians, it's a massive change from their previous home, Nella Hall in Twickenham. They spend time actually... Uh, in their own um, sort of space, in particular in the uh, rehearsal bunks, you know, at, at Nella Hall we had six spaces for people of about sort of 50 or 60 people. Here uh, we have 96 individual practice bunks. What an amazing reimagination of a prison cell this is. Come on in. As you can see, quite small but absolutely perfect for individual musicians to practice. Three foot walls either side make it totally soundproof and well here we've got a trombone player all ready to go. The musicians as well can personalise this room so it's just perfect for them. <laughs> After touring the new facilities, it was time for Princess Anne to hear some music from some of those training here. I was I was very nervous to to meet her at first, but I think it was um, she was very she's very been very supportive of military music in the past. Very interesting to chat to her about my experience in training and my experience in the band service so far as well. So it was a, a thoroughly thoroughly interesting experience. The new joint site can host up to 100 musicians for their training at a time. Currently, it's got an approximate split of 60% Royal Marines and 40% Army personnel. And bringing the two groups of musicians together has major benefits. I'm really excited. We're quite close with the Royal Marines already, but I think this will allow us to work clo more closely together because we won't have to share facilities. So currently, we don't work at the same time. We practice separately, whereas being able to practice in one facility at one time will allow us to mingle a bit more. Just couldn't be happier to see the Alford Schools of Music open. It's been quite a long project, which was slightly delayed by COVID. Uh, we've been involved in this in one way or the other since 2018, and I, I have personally seen it uh, develop over the last couple of years into a really special facility. The Royal Marines have been based here since 1996, but to mark the redevelopment work and the new army residence, the Princess Royal unveiled a plaque. The new building will be up and running early next year. Tim Cooper, Forces News, Portsmouth. Thanks for watching. For more from Forces News, like and subscribe to our channel.